Welcome back and let's get down to the top 5 ways to use your door window sensor. I can assure you that you will find at least some of those examples smart, practical or maybe even funny. Let's go! Just before we start the magical countdown, let me clarify that while I promised you 5 ideas on how to benefit from Fibaro door window sensor, some of them will be a larger concept and will result in more than one example. Uh, the bottom line is that you will get more than you came here for. Let's start with supposedly the most obvious use of the sensor, which the very name suggests is securing doors and windows. We will focus on a specific scenario though. Imagine that you have a construction that is underway or has been suspended. You probably have not set up the proper alarm system yet, but you want to be aware of any unwanted guests. A very effective and quick to set up alternative for an alarm system would be to place Fibaro door window sensor in the most strategic places of your property. As soon as any door or window is opened, you will be notified about it. Now, what if there is no permanent access to the internet or power outages happen on a regular basis? Hmm, a simple backup power source like a dedicated power bank should be enough to support your Z-Wave gateway. Remember that Z-Wave battery supported sensors like this one are not affected by outages directly. Adjusting your heating and cooling system is important in summer and winter. During any heat wave, you want to make sure that your air conditioner is on only when all the windows are closed. If you don't, not only will it affect the air conditioner's performance, but it will also increase the power and consumption required, well, to keep the device working properly. Knowing that there is at least one window left open minimizes this problem and can be especially helpful in cases of large houses and large apartments. If you go just one smart step further, well, you can make the air conditioner communicate with your sensor. Now, the cooling process in that specific scenario can stop automatically whenever a window is open. Such an automation could be accomplished in a number of ways. For instance, by connecting the uh, air conditioner to a smart outlet, smart wall plug, including a heavy duty switch, or using an air conditioner adapter. A similar scenario happens during winter. An open window means heat loss and that directly affects the increased heating costs. Here's an automation that will save you time and also money. If you use uh, electric heaters, you can connect them with your smart uh, home by using a smart plug and the heater will turn off the moment a window is opened. Water radiators equipped with, let's say, smart Z-Wave valves will work in a similar way. Instead of increasing temperature when cold air gets inside, they will behave accordingly to the state of the mm, sensor, right? This means that they will react to the position of the sensor and the magnet. If there is one group of people whose dexterity, tenacity and speed you can never underestimate, it's the children. All you parents out there know exactly what I'm talking about. My two-year-old is like a young MacGyver. Always seems to find a way to open a locked cupboard, reach places far beyond her reach, and also take advantage of basically any door, gate, or even lid left open. What you do is you take the sensor and place it in a cupboard with, let's say, household chemistry, on baby gates, or any other Pandora's box to prevent contact with dangerous objects and dangerous substances. At this point, some of you may say, well, Charles, um, nice try, but you know what? I have a teenager and the whole cupboard examples, mm, they are not that relevant to me anymore. Mm, okay, fair enough, but uh, older kids tend to be in a hurry all the time, right? And they may forget about little things, such as closing the refrigerator door after getting a little snack. Not shutting it properly will make warm air 
enter the fridge and ultimately force the compressor to work harder to cool it again. Solution? You're looking at it. Let's stop here for a moment and think about the loved ones that we are unable to visit often. You can do your best and give them a phone call whenever it is possible, but it's likely that every once in a while the feeling of insecurity or even guilt will crawl in. You can't be around all the time, yet you do want to know that everything is okay. We all tend to forget about certain things from time to time, and while leaving the dishes in the sink will, well, do no harm, not taking your daily medication may have some severe consequences in the long run. While nothing can replace a face-to-face -face interaction, a simple notification that indicates a, let's say, medicine cabinet that was open or that the back door was closed can bring relief and some peace of mind. Now, what about pet owners who keep asking themselves the same question over and over again every single day? Is Max back home or is he still playing outside? Install the door window sensor by the pet door and you will know exactly when your pet decided to use the entrance. One less idea on how to use the bar of door window sensor, one that is loosely connected to dogs, or should I actually say their arch nemesis, the mailman. Remember that one time when you were away from home, perhaps at the office, and you were wondering whether that very important package or a very important letter arrived? Well, wonder no more. What you do is you take the sensor, you install it by the mail slot, and you will wonder no more. These were the top five ideas on how to make your life easier and safer with door window sensor. Let us know about any other examples on how you would use this device. Can't wait to hear about your ideas. If you enjoyed the video, please remember to subscribe and see you next time.